Hello, welcome to the Delaware Mortgage Rate Weekly Update for the week of June 11, 2012. I'm John Thomas with Primary Residential Mortgage here to give you your update. Well, if we look at the bond chart, which we have on the screen, you can see that mortgage rates have been on this upward trend. Our mortgage bonds have been on this upward trend, climbing higher. Uh, hasn't been a straight climb. If you notice, it's been up and down, up and down, but the, the trend is upward, and it looks like the trend will remain upward. But uh, in the short term, rates are very volatile, which means mortgage rates could sell off and go lower, could go higher. So we're recommending locking any loans closing in the next 30 days. If you're going to be closing 60 days or longer, we recommend floating as the long-term trend should hold, as you can see from the chart. Now, what's in the news making this stuff happen? Well, if you look at the chart on the screen there, you can see initial jobless claims came in at 377000 for June 2nd. Uh, still pretty high t number, even though it is the first time it was lower since April. That's still a lot of um, initial claims, and that's people that file claims looking for work. Does not count the people that took part-time work or stopped filing claims. Uh, last week we saw Federal Chairman Ben Bernanke make a uh, report to Congress, and he did not mention anything about QE3. That sent the stock market rally to a fizzle. Stocks reversed course, and that helped mortgage rates finish the week pretty strong. We also saw the credit rating agency Fitch announce that they are going to downgrade the U.S. credit from AAA rating if Congress does not fix the budget deficit. Huge problem basically telling us get our act together or we'll be downgraded and we'll end up just like Europe, uh, Greece, and Spain, which is bad news. We've been watching these updates. Um, and it, it, the, the drama that's going on in Europe is another big factor to help keep our rates low. We saw Greece have a big problem. Spain is now in the news with big problems. So that Euro drama is going to keep playing out. And that's what should keep the long-term trend of rates staying low, at least for the next two, three, maybe even six months. Uh, local news, we've got the next free first-time homebuyer seminar this coming Saturday, June 16th. That's in Newark, Delaware at the Christiana Hilton Hotel, 10 to noon. Um, or again from 1 to 3, and then we have it in Dover, uh, which is Tuesday, June 19th, from 6.30 to 8.30. You can register for either one of those by calling our office, 302-703-0727, or you can register online, www.DelawareHomeBuyerSeminar.com. If you need help with a refinance or a purchase of a home in Delaware, give us a call or apply online, www.PRMIDelaware.com. There's a bunch of programs going on right now to help you take, care, um, take advantage of these low record refinance rates. There's an FHA Streamline program. There's the HARP Refinance program for underwater homeowners. VA loans have a Streamline program as well as USDA. So if you have a loan program and your rates um, 5% or higher, give us a call, shoot us an email, and we'll take care of you. Till next week.